Your network is your net worth. As a record producer, large recording studio owner, I need to create a sense of community. So I decided to throw a music festival. I had 12 bands in one day, and Garnished Press Cost Crunchy was on television, and this, uh, it was a success. It actually worked. I thought, hey, I created a festival, and maybe I can do something else. So I decided I'm gonna start a TV show. I hired a cameraman, uh, armed him with some, what I thought were really great questions to ask the band. And he went to the studio, captured it, looked at the footage and realized this is a complete disaster, man. This completely sucked. So I needed to learn how to do research. I needed to learn to ask questions, to do better interviews that actually brought out of people something that was interesting. So I learned through this process of trying to create a TV show that you can't just hope that people say stuff. I mean, you're filmmakers, you're watching this, I'm speaking to the choir here, but I found out the hard way. Spent a lot of money to figure out you can't just do that. So I figured it out. I learned a lot of jobs I didn't know the name to. Uh, and I learned how to become a filmmaker through creating this TV show, which got on television, went cross country and was successful. But it, it got me into film, but it didn't keep me on the right path in my mind. I ended up doing car commercials, I ended up doing a lot of lifestyle stuff, events and some weddings and stuff, but I lost storytelling along the way. I lost like, hey, I want to make a difference in people's lives. I want people to watch the films that I make and go, man, that, that really made me think about something differently. And maybe it's, maybe it's clarifying a misconception that somebody had. That's what I want to do. That's why I'm here.